My father was a mercenary, and he was recruited by Aguirre's father in Algiers. When my father died protecting him, he took me in, raised Aguirre and me together, like brothers. Aguirre's daughter, Ana, had fallen ill. She was all he had. He vowed he wouldn't lose her. We fought the ocean, only to be beaten by the river. The jungle fought our every step. I would have done anything to find the Tears of the Moon and save Aguirre's daughter, even chart the Amazon. You were Aguirre's cartographer. You drew my map. Frank! You really think my work is extraordinary? I think you are a minor master of your time. Minor? <coughs> one by one, the jungle took us. We were all but dead. Still, Aguirre wouldn't turn back. There was no world for him without his daughter in it. And then they came. We would have all died had they not saved us with the tears of the moon. The petal's magic was real. Its powers unlocked by the chief and his daughter. All that was broken, the petals mended. And all at once, we were revived. And Aguirre was happy because he was closer than ever to finding a cure for his daughter. But he grew impatient. Aguirre demanded they give him the arrowhead and take him to the tree. The chief refused. Despite all the kindness they'd shown us, he would have killed every last one of them. I loved Aguirre, but I couldn't be part of the madness. No voy a haceros daño. Solo quiero la flecha. And I couldn't just stand by. Entregando la flecha! Corre! El acero de mi hermano corta más profundo. Traidor. knew he was breathing his last breath, and he used that breath to protect the arrowhead and their sacred tree. He cursed Aguirre, he cursed all of us, so that we could never leave sight of the river again, or the jungle would take us back to it, for all eternity. They hated me for betraying him. He found me over the years, and we fought. And fought again. I got tired of being stabbed, so I made sure he would never hurt me or anyone else again. I trapped them in a cave. Where the jungle couldn't take them back to the river. And for 300 years, the jungle ravaged their bodies, turning them into the monsters they are today. <laughs>